what's good everybody and for this video i'm going to be showing y'all a couple of things that y'all can change in your settings that can improve your pvps and just your overall character all right y'all so for the first one we're going to be talking about the end game depth of field effects and what it does so now we're going to notice that when it's on as you're aiming towards a target everything that's on your sides is going to be less visible so you won't be able to see that good so now we're just going to try to turn it off and then now we're going to be able to see what it looks like now while you're aiming at a target you'll see that none of your visual will be blurred out on the side now some of y'all might know about this one it's about the measurement system of how you can be able to change from miles or you can change from kilometers this is definitely really useful to use, especially for the people that don't live in the US country that would like to change it up. In one of the updates in 2023, they recently have a new way that we can just hold to sprint now. So we don't have to keep continuously tapping that X button, y'all. And this is definitely useful for some PVPs. All right, y'all. And so for this next tip, this is gonna be for all the players that like to play in first person. It's really good because you can be able to get more onto your screen. And for me, honestly, it actually looks a lot better and you can be able to see a lot more. So for this last tip, y'all, we're going to be talking about this first person combat role. So as you notice that as you're rolling, you're not going to be able to see anything, especially if you're in a PvP battle. And as you're doing that, you're blocking all of your view. And now we're going to go right over there to that first person combat role and we're going to turn that off. I hope these tips helped you out y'all and take care.